Android Galaxy Greece, my name is Andreas and today we're taking a look at screen recording of our Android or uh, phone or tablet to our Mac computer, through our Mac computer. So this is the easiest of all methods. We're using just a USB cable provider with our device. Um, we are going to use USB debugging, but I'll show you that in the recording how it's done. And you can do this, you can use this for previewing some kind of launcher or photo to record it, but I'm not recommending this for gaming. Uh, if you want to show off some games, you'll need an HDMI capture because this, uh, this method has a very low frame rate. So gaming is not at all good like using this method. So we're just going to jump to the computer and see how it's done. Okay, so we're going to need to enable the USB debugging actually to do this. And I'll screen record that to show you how to uh, enable USB debugging if you don't know how to do it already because it's in the developer options. And you're going to need the Android SDK for this, which I'll have the link for that in the description right below that like button with uh, all the other links to the social media. And once we'll open it, we'll open the folder uh, SDK and then go to Platform Tools. And we're not actually going to open Platform Tools. We're just going to uh, right click on it and we'll select the new terminal choice, which is second from last. It'll open the terminal and we'll go dot slash adb space shell, enter, and then uh, screen record space uh, dash dash verbose space uh, slash, and then again, uh, and then an SD card. And then we'll have to dash and we'll have to name it. We'll name this Nexus MP4, Nexus.mp4. And once we're ready, we'll uh, hit enter and it'll start recording our, uh, phone screen. There it goes. Now you can actually see what I'm doing on the computer. Uh, I can just see it on the phone. And uh, once we'll go and I'm, I'm actually going now to the USB debugging menu to show you if you don't know how to do that, how to do that. And uh, once you're done with your uh, recording, you hit control S, control C. And there it goes, it stopped. Now, in order to see the file that we've just created, which was, remember, nexus.mp4, that's why I've uh, named it, we'll have to close all of this up and open up our uh, file manager. Uh, so I'll open up uh, Android File Transfer. And there we go. It's in a, file, uh, a folder labeled music. It always does that. I don't know why. That's not even my music. And we'll drag and drop that on the uh, desktop. And now we'll open the screen record. Now, the very low frame rate is because of the screen recording of the Mac, not uh, the screen record of the phone. If you do it on your own uh, phone, it's perfectly smooth. And we'll go to do the developer options, which we can open by tapping seven times on the build number on a, in about phone. And there we go, we have a developer options menu cropping up. And a USB debugging, which it's is checked on uh, mine and you'll have to do the same to uh, work on your screen recording. So this was the simplest way of screen recording your Android uh, tablet or phone on your uh, from your Mac computer and uh, we'll see you in the next video.